Today we're going to take a look at the dome feature in SolidWorks. The dome feature is a great way to add a raised piece of uh, geometry to any sort of surface. Um, the dome feature is very easy to use, um, very easy to control as well. So for instance, if I want to just take a flat surface and add a little bit of dome geometry to it, it's very simple to do. So all I need to do is use my dome feature, which is not by default on your feature manager. So you could actually search for your command over here and then uh, run it right from there. And then you'll see that this allows me to add that dome information to that face. You can control the offset distance of that dome. So if I wanted a 2 millimeter dome, for instance, instead of a uh, full 10 millimeter dome, I could do that. But you also have the ability to control the direction. Um, so if I want to, I can flip the direction of that dome to get either in an interior dome or an exterior dome. Uh, you'll also notice that we can uh, control the direction itself. So if I want to uh, add a sketch relation or a sketch direction to dome in a specific direction, I could do that as well. So you get some nice options for that right there. But what it ends up doing is giving me a nice uh, dome feature that's developed outward from that surface. Now one trick I like to use a lot with this dome feature is to first create a sketch for a split line for the uh, actual geometry of the dome shape that I would like. And then I'll create, like for instance, if I want to create a, uh, a circular button style dome here, uh, I'll just create that uh, sketch and then I'll use my split line command. Uh, we'll grab that from our uh, surfaces tab here and split this face. So that'll just go ahead and create two separate faces. And now I can take this one face and use my dome command to add the dome on that particular uh, piece of geometry. One thing you'll notice is that with a circle you have uh, the option of using either an elliptical dome and get a much uh, nicer looking dome shape or you could do a uh, typical circular style dome here as well. So you have that option uh, for a the two different dome styles that you would like to create there. So if I want just a simple like a uh, two millimeter dome here or one millimeter or whatever uh, dimension I would like I can create that dome on the fly. So if we want to do a two millimeter and create a nice elliptical dome we're in, we'll end up with uh, some really good looking geometry like that. So that's how you can use that uh, dome feature in SolidWorks uh, and that's been my tip for today. Thank you for watching.